Hey y'alls, today we're going to go over the Boolean Pi menu real quick. Um, to bring it up, it's Control B. We got a bunch of options on the left side, Boolean Add, Subtract, Slice. On the right side, Live Add, Live Subtract, Live Subtract, Inset. And the difference between these two sides is on the left side are direct cuts, which um, basically what you see is what you get when you use these cuts. It's done, it's finished. But on the right side, when you cut using these live cuts, you get some flexibility and we can move things around after the fact. So let's let's see what how that works. If I double click this, shift D to duplicate, bring it down, and we can go control B, Boolean subtract. And now we've got a direct cut. Here's our geometry. I can edit it, extrude, inset modify it how I see fit and we can undo this now go back to where we started and here we are and let's do again control B live subtract on the right side now kind of looks like we've done the same thing here but it's actually different because we've got a, a boolean modifier which means if I go control B one, once more toggle cutters we can see we've got our old cutter here which we can move around and have added right so I can also begin editing this cutter switch to, to faces and back to object to refresh that and now we can see that it is it is updating as one would expect you gotta switch to faces and back to object with control space and that's kind of an annoying thing about using these live cutters. And I hope they fix that at some point. But anyways, um, also, let me delete this thing. Shift A, 32 side cylinder up here. And let's bring it over to the side a bit. Control B. This live subtract inset is really cool. So let's, let's add that. And it's actually cut an extra hole and then inset the cutter just a little bit just a tiny bit so this is great for bolt holes and um, part lines and this kind of kind of work here so you can also go to object mode and move this around and the cutter hole will follow that inset object so pretty cool stuff and um, one other note um, let me open this up what uh, let me delete this one other thing um, when we're in object mode we can duplicate this cube got two cubes now two different objects and I can go control B live subtract that works as expected but if I do the same thing on the left side it throws an error um, because th these left side things only work in edit mode so make sure you're all together you can go click this one shift click control J now switch to faces now we're in edit mode and now we can use the left side just like that the right side stuff works in edit mode or object mode and I hope that's not too confusing um, to be honest I usually do everything in edit mode just like this because they both work in edit mode so I don't have to worry about it and um, yeah that's pretty much it guys happy booleaning and um, see you next time